Okay, so I want to show you how to enable and disable the one-click trading. So one-click trading is uh, typically efficient if you are working in a market whereby is uh, typically volatile or you just don't want to undergo the process of uh, just like having to confirm the two-step authentication factor for for trading and other kind of stuff what i mean is uh, if you like for example want to drag these from here to here you just like have to confirm it uh, to, um, manually in that case so that is now the modification of the stop loss so i have to maybe do that and confirm it manually so if i do that and then you can see i have to confirm this manually so if i want it then i click on ok then click on done to some extent this can be uh, you know a kike or maybe you want to open a position let's say you want to open a buy position in that case then just like need to come over here and uh, you need to maybe set the stop loss and the take profit let's say okay what did this says there maybe you want to open a buy position at that particular point then just like come over here need to set the stop loss which is now like typically let's say 20 uh, 20 let's say 29 point let's say 0 uh, 5 let me say 7 or uh, let me just have one or a two. Now you can see the, it is to some extent very, very archaic for the stop loss. That is a buy stop uh, buy. So buy stop loss should always be below. I get that. So let's say 28 uh, or even let's say 26. Now you can see the market is already moving. And uh, yeah, let me say 26 to or uh, 5. In that case, then I have to say profit is 29 point let's say uh, 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 maybe one or uh, maybe one to or whichever then go and click on buy at the market at the current market price and all that kind of stuff now can see i do have an order over there if i maybe i want to modify the the stop loss over here to maybe over here then i have to always confirm so that if it is accepted so to some extent the super kike so what you can do is then just over to tools go to options then go to trade tab over here and where you see one click trading tab just check on it then you have to uh, of course you know go over the disclaimer over there and then after you have read the disclaimer of course i know you trade this one then just like check the i accept these terms and conditions for the one click trading so don't have to confirm the these uh, you can see so any mistake or yeah <laughs> that you do in this uh, case the broker doesn't get concerned to that so it is a own solid decision and all that kind of stuff so just click on okay after accepting the the terms of course then click on okay over there so now if i want to directly modify the stop loss i could just do it and it is automatically modified so yeah if i want to modify the stop loss it is automatically modified if if let's say i want to open this position over here now so i could just like go ahead and once i do click on the buy i don't have the two-factor authentication feature over there if i buy i buy at that particular point and that is all the really open a position over there let me check this out yeah? if we did open a position if i did uh, open a buy just like you don't get the two-factor authentication it is now uh, everything is not my hand i do own the financial constraints over there so if i just like want to close over here i can just like do that and it is automatically closed if i want to close i can just cancel the order to close the order at that particular point if i want to modify the take profit it can be done easily in that case but just like uh, dragging and uh, dropping it over there so now if you want to turn that off you can just go to the tools 
then options again and just like uncheck the one tra one click trading the impression okay so now if i want to close this one i will get the two factor authentication of course so whereby i have to actually confirm i want to close at that particular uh, market price in that case if i want to drag now then yeah i want i will actually have to like uh, yeah so yeah that is the major way of just like mm, yeah you can see i do have to click on all that and accept the terms and the conditions and that is all to switch like back and forth from a one click trading that i case so yeah that is all uh, you need to know about these uh, one click trading now so yep